Hey, what's up guys? I'm at the store. I'm gonna buy me a, a steak for dinner. And, oh yeah. Alright guys, it's been a while. It's been a while since I washed my car, so I'm doing it today. You can tell, but three, two, one. The next day. Hey, what's up guys? Big D Keto here. Uh, I just got back from the park. I did like a, an hour. Did like an hour of cardio, walking the trail. Did a little bit of jogging. And now I'm going to make some Keto chocolate milkshake. So, oh yeah. Yeah, so this is right. Usually I put like a one cup of coconut milk, but this one here. And this too is about to be gone. So I'll usually I put like one third cup of uh, heavy whipping cream thickness but this is almost out so I'll put that bitch in here. Yeah. I get like one tablespoon of the cocoa powder. I'm seeing Hershey cocoa powder. Yeah. Do like one tablespoon. Not bad. I'll do a little extra. That's done. And I got this uh, organic stevia. You know, so Put like about maybe two tablespoons. Yeah, that's about it. Yeah. And now what I do, I add like a, like a slice of a carry gold butter. Really grass-fed butter is really good. And get more fats in my shake. That's really good. Probably get another. that out of the way and now I put one tablespoon of coconut oil as you can see that coconut oil yeah like one tablespoon yeah. Uh, this is about right there and yeah so all that fat and then put energy and up next I put I add some ice so I get like a little slushy flavor taste not flavor add ice so to be a little bit colder Kind of hot outside. I thought a couple of ice. Okay, guys. Now the next thing I do, guys, I blend it. Got a nutrient bullet here, so make sure it's tight. Yeah, mm -hmm. blend it. <laughs> okay, after that's done, check it out. Yeah. Yeah. Got it. Plenty as you go. Go back in the ground. Okay. Now look at that. Woo! Delicious keto chocolate milkshake. Alright y'all. Cheers. Mm. <laughs> Good. 
Hey, what's up guys? Um, and this video is called Small Victories. If you guys know a picture I posted in my last video, the one I met John Glad, Obese Beast. I was wearing the green uh, t-shirt and I'm gonna put it on, see how it fits me now. All right guys, this is it. This is the t-shirt I had when I met John Glad, Obese Beast. This is it. Alright, I'm gonna put it on. See? Now it doesn't fit me no more, it's big on me now. Look at look at the size, look at I mean, like I said guys, uh, small victories makes a big difference and it's okay to celebrate small victories because, you know what I mean, my weight loss is a journey, so it's, it's going to take a while until I reach my goal. Knowing that the fact that this shirt didn't fit, doesn't fit me no more, that I used to be snug on me, that's like one of the best feelings I could have, you know, compared to seeing the number on the scale, which I still do, you know, to track where I'm at. Like, this is gonna be tired of me, guys. Look, look at this. Hey, man, clothes don't lie. I tell you guys, and that's that shows true results. Fitness, health. So, like, this is the Star Wars t shirt. This is like my favorite t shirt. Again, I'm gonna post uh, the same picture in this video to show you guys the big difference, you know. And hopefully, this guy, John Glad, Obese Beast, you know, sees my video, you know. And I kind of want to talk about that a little bit is that. I can honestly say that that was like my starting point of creating my YouTube channel because before I, I mean, I have I was never in my mind to ever create a channel, never. It didn't hit me like right away until I thought about it, you know, and just really seeing the um, my old pictures and, and stuff that don't fit me no more is really encouraging, really um, inspiring too to me personally, you know that. This thing is, is a big difference, you know. I will put clothing over the weight scale any time of day. Look, look at this, man. It's huge on me. Big. You know, I just want to share that with you guys. The little small victories, you know. I just want to give you guys an insight, you know. Like where I'm at right now. I'm at 253, 253 right now. So I'm really close to breaking that 250. Most importantly, I go by the clothes I wear and how I feel. And I'm really active now at the gym, and I go walking. So, so tonight I'm gonna go to the gym and work out again because I'm really excited and I feel really inspired. Man, look at this shirt, man! Look at this. Woo! Doesn't don't fit me no more. Like you could know, you could see it in the picture that that this T-shirt I was wearing, like snug, I'm small on me and snug. Being snug, I'm you could tell the my stomach was sticking out. And now I'm seeing like. Three, four months later, or five, six months later, you know, don't fit me no more. And it's something like I want to keep in mind that, like, like, I'm still gonna keep this shirt just to remind me of like where I was before, you know. And like, hopefully, someday I will, I will meet John Glad, Obese Beast again in the near future, you know. Hopefully, like, I'm gonna post this in my Instagram account too, the picture, and this little before and after, cause you know, that's a big thing. You know, and I guess, like I said, guys, small victories does count, you know. So, like, I'm happy and excited, and I know you guys are excited. So, and again, I just want to say thank you for all the support. And I finally reached over 40 subscribers. Yeah, I'm excited about that. I'll see you guys in a bit, all right? Bam.
20 minutes later. <laughs> Hopefully you enjoyed this video, you know, there will be more to come, and see you guys later. Yeah.